Hi y'all folks, this is Max from GalaxyS2Root.com So uh, we're going to root our ICS um, on our Galaxy S2 GTI 900 um, Please do not try to do this on um, AT&T or Sprint uh, or T-Mobile So first you will need to uh, put it in download mode, hold down volume down, um, power and the center button and uh, pull it down and hit the volume up and we're just going to basically flash this kernel we should be all good to go and let's go to our computer next you'll need to download um, Odin v 185zip odd links and uh, you get these two files and you also need to download uh, i9100 xxlpq blah blah tar Oh, sorry, no. CF root dash CSG2 uh, blah blah CMW5.zip. Um, you just need this file here, the CF root. And uh, we're just going to run it and flash it. Uh, for Mac or Linux, um, you can use Heimdall, and I'll have another instruction set for that. So let's run Odin real quick. And also, if you have drivers installed, it should show up as a uh, yellow when you connect it. Um, if you don't, go install Samsung Keys. I'll have links uh, where you can download it, install it, unplug and plug your phone back in, and you should get this yellow thing. Um, next, just p choose PDA. And... Um, where'd it go? Um, sorry, I have to unzip this. Sorry, you have to unzip it first. I'm an idiot. <laughs> um, see, unzip that CF root uh, after you get it. And then you get a tar file that you can flash. So I got it right here. It's the tar file. Let me go back to Odin. Choose PDA. Um, go find the file that you just unzipped. This is the kernel that comes with Clockwork Mod Recovery and Root. And will root your ICS on Galaxy S2 GT i9100. Open. Hit Start. It'll flash the kernel, which has a rooted kernel. Reboot. It'll reboot. And, uh, let's see here. You'll get the triangle. Um, if you want to get rid of tr the triangle, you can always unroot it. It's not a big deal. Um, I have unrooting directions to ICS. Just unroot it if you're going to return it to for warranty or something. And you should be all good to go. And Anyway, I'm going to switch the camera angle. I'll, I'll be back when this completely boots up. So that booted up real quick here. Um, let's go see. Should have super user now or... Um, Where'd it go? Oh, Super SU. It's the same thing. Super U Super SU is the uh, the new kind of um, super user thing. So click on Super U Super SU, and uh, it says SU binary needs to be updated. Continue. Say yes. And okay. And uh, let me see here. You can go run uh, rooted apps. Do, do, do. Let me go download. Um, you can verify it's working. Go to your Go Play. Hold on. Go to the market or the Play Store or whatever, um, and type uh, Titanium Backup. Um, oh, I actually it's installed. Let me open it. it. Should ask you for Super User Access here. Asking, and you can say Grant. If you see that, that means your phone has been rooted. Um, there you go. And you can also now access Clockwork Mod Recovery by holding down volume, volume up, center, home button, and the power button together. And this is where you can install, backup, and uh, restore ROMs. I highly advise you to back up your first rooted ROM after you root it before you install anything. And this will get you into Clockwork Mod Recovery um, here. All you gotta do is uh, 
go to backup and storage backup and restore and hit backup that's pretty much it and if you um, I have a, a whole bunch of stuff tips and ROM reviews and whatnot you can go check it out galaxys 2 rootcom um, if you have a Galaxy S2 root don't forget to sign up for our email list at galaxys 2 rootcom we update you once or twice a week with stuff like this ROMs, ROMs of the week and tips and more just for you and me um, I don't share your email with anyone else and if you're on YouTube don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to my channel um, if you have thanks a lot and also share it with your friends on Twitter Facebook and Google Plus anyway thanks you guys um, for supporting my channel we're gonna get real high on Android today I'm gonna, I'm gonna go get more energy drinks <laughs> see y'all later